Hello fellow potters, uh, my name's Sam, I'm coming from the land of Down Under, 21st of June 2008, Saturday night. Uh, been on new YouTube looking about and there's a lot of stuff there on pots, just making pots, making all sorts of pots and I thought something up there to do with scales might be worthwhile. You see people want I'll make out something out of this amount of clay or blah blah blah. Okay, so I've got a few scars I've had in my studio from the day one that I've collected and used. Some I use all the time, some I don't use very often. So here's some I've got. Keep your eye out for them because you will use them. This one, good old Bertha. Bertha is used for weighing out clay. If I'm going to make out four, five, or fifty bowls and a hundred grams, hundred grams, sorry, kilo, clay goes in, way you are. This thing doesn't matter what sort of an angle you're on. It'll level itself out up to where it can go. It's quite easy to be looked after, cast iron, unrustable naturally and can be left laying around the workshop anywhere uh, can be knocked about a bit don't that you want to do that sort of thing but very handy piece of gear and they're not real dear here in Australia you can pick them up for about 65 dollars second hand this is the next machine this is called a triple balance beam or triple beam balance. Whatever part of the world you come from or how you want to say it. This was originally the one I used for making glazes. It has an adjustable screw here at the back that you can put your weight on and it measures off here. You've got, um, I'll bring it in closer for you to have a look at. You can have from one gram to tenths of a gram here. You've got 100 grams, 200, 300, 400. And then the back one is up to 100 in lots of 10. So, you know, 200, you know, whatever you want. I can't see that. You guys are, but you can probably see it. Where you can measure out, watch it come up, and it will be spot on. Only drawback with this one is if you want to put a big container on here. The next one up, and the best one, for making your glazes, is a simply the same sort. A little bit more robust. And similar thing, exactly the same sort of machine, only this one has what's called its own balance on this side. This little thing here moves up and down and no matter what, whatever you put on here, you counteract that weight with this and it will even itself out. So you can put on this, counteract the weight of that with this so that it sits in the middle Turn it around, give you a bit of a look. If I wasn't on a block of clay, I'd be able to do it for you. Move it till it sits there in the middle and away with your measurements. No dramas. This is the best one to have. This little baby I haven't used yet. And it measures in tenths of a gram. It specialises in that field of one tenth of a gram. Um, I do know people that use it for glazes to measure up for adding oxide, especially cobalt carbonate, things like that, where you don't need much in there. If you want to do a 50 gram test, you might only want half of a gram of cobalt carbonate to do your test. So, that's what this little baby is used for. What we're going to do in the next video I'll make, because is 
is I'm going to use the triple balance beam. I'm going to make a glaze for you, a sample glaze for you. So, until next time, bye-bye from Australia.